This is Face and Dragon Age Inquisition LP, episode 64, and in this episode we'll be doing more exploration in here. Did some exploration of camera, searched a bit of a weird uh, sand zone, but didn't find much in there, just, uh, you know, a few plants and uh, some swirling sands. <laughs> so. Yeah, back to questing in here, collecting some shards and uh, I don't know, maybe getting to a story mission finally? No, not exactly story mission, but uh, main mission that actually opened this region. Okay, at the moment we're in a place called Elizabeth's Garden, don't know why, but that's how it's called. Hmm. Okay, this is just a uh, way down with no path up. Okay. It's pretty cool region after all. <laughs> all the level scaling and, uh, you know, uneasy terrain. Seems, uh, you know, quite realistic and all. Wow, bloodstone. I don't know. Uh, sounds familiar, but uh, can't really say for sure. Okay. Seem to be having inventory problems again. <laughs> okay, so last sun. This is where we ended the uh, last episode, I think. Yeah, a cooler in there. And this uh, is a landmark or just a... Just a statue. Okay. Been quite a few landmarks looking like that. Hmm. Quite a few of these here. Dragon Forts. Let's hope it's not because some dragon flew by and, you know, pooped a bit or something. <laughs> this cave, okay. Maybe I've been here? There's light, so probably I did. But uh, it's, uh, I don't know. Not 100%. Oh yeah, I've been here. Yeah, floating loot from spider. And, uh... Wait, maybe I can pick it up. I don't know. There's a small possibility in here. Come on, Eric. Either get off or get the loot yourself. <laughs> nah, it's basically a waste of time. <laughs> just, just greedy, greedy, too greedy. No, never mind. <laughs> Waste of uh, precious time in here. Floating loot should be left behind. <laughs> Shouldn't trust such things. Okay, maybe we'll get the ring. Found. Oh, wait a moment. I bet this is another, you know, swirly sands area. Because uh, in those you can actually walk, but cannot run. That's sort of a. Uh, Invisible wall. <laughs> Extraordinaire. Nothing worth living there. <laughs> but what's behind that hill? Eh, nothing, probably. <laughs> or such the game developers wants you to believe. Okay. Enough, uh, enough conspiracy theories. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Actually find a way to go here. How do I do that? <laughs> uh, it's complicated. Want to buy a levitation spell or something. <laughs> so can, you know, look... Oh! Spider! Ow! Look behind the rocks and uh, stop in the other side. <laughs> With help of uh, navigation. I don't know. Can I like use a tech camera for something like that? 
Eh. Don't know. Don't know. Maybe. Let's find out. <laughs> nah. It's not, not even the angle possible. Never mind. That was an idea. <laughs> Cannot even, you know, look at the mountain like that. <laughs> Never mind. Oh wait, where was it? Just the nugs? Okay. Nug predator. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh, hmm. Yeah, there was a way in here that uh, was on the other side and it probably led where I'm aiming to go. So yeah, no problem here. Ah uh, yeah, here we go. And the notary are already here. And like always. We're gonna get some butt kicking involved here. <laughs> here we go. Get wrecked. Because face is geared and he's commanding. <laughs> oh, hell we go. Some more damage. Wait a moment, I wanted to shadow that guy. Never mind. Blackwall is already on it. <laughs> Just bash these guys in. Burn, baby, burn. Oh yeah. <laughs> Drag one guy, kick the other guy. Pure awesomeness. <laughs> Shit, block mark. <laughs> Got carried away here. Still rocking the. Have any advice for fighting demons, Solus? Survive the first thirty heartbeats, and you have already won. So I should try not to die. Helpful. I mean, the demons are rarely intelligent enough to change their tactics. If you focus on defending yourself, you will see the full range of their abilities within the first thirty heartbeats. By then, you should be able to find a weakness and exploit it. Ah, that is helpful. I will try to remember that. Also, try not to die. <laughs> so, as I said, uh, still rocking the, you know, Buckler of Gondor. <laughs> For inspiration. Yeah, have a problem with uh, inventory space again. Yep. Still need to find some merchant here. Probably none in here. Or get the, uh, you know, backpack upgrade. Because that's important. Oh man. Yeah, let's just break some beta. Just not worth it. Armor is probably much more, you know, worthy to sell. Okay. That's some uh, cave in there. Probably something uh, we can explore as well. Gonna do it later. Okay, some innocent animal got wrecked in here. Look up, uh, unlock with a power of six shards. Find shards by using a clara. Okay. Well, I kind of got some shards already. Uh, tracing from a temple doors, an inscription taken at the temple doors in uh, a forbidden oa oasis, followed by a translation. The writing is shaky and uneven, as though the writer labored to complete a task. Emma, Solas, him, Vardinan, Tel Garas, Solasan, Melana, and Athim, Lasanasti. Arrogance became our end, come not to a prideful place, not left humility, grand favor. Okay, that was probably something elven. I get it. Something feels wrong here. It's worse by the door. Okay, shards open the uh, passage. I'm interested, does all the shards do that? Or they have some other purpose? I'm not sure. Or is this just a requirement to pass? Do we have uh, some of them? I don't know. It's uh, tough to say. 
Mm, so much stuff here. Really need to get some uh, selling done, probably. Eh, it's probably not gonna use that. Destroy. Fine. And uh, armor? Yeah. Never mind the blade. Eh. Probably gonna find something good in here. At the door. It's gone now. I believe it was a magical ward of sorts. A warning man. Or a test. Explains why the miners kept away. Yeah. I didn't pass a test. Okay. Just some Fenix in here. Nothing too fancy so far. Come on. Where is this place? So another test? We need another artifact. Oh really? Uh, yeah, a male one, I guess. Activate. Some XP. It should be harder for tears to form here. Okay, energize and uh, maybe use a whale fire. Maybe some secret in here. Come on. There we go. Something, something, something. Let's not open the doors yet. Uh, place uh, seems ancient and seems uh, you know worthy of exploration. Some weird thing here. Hey, a rune or not? Uh, ancient writing. Uh, the meaning behind the flowing ancient script is obscure at first, but slowly forms. May the path bestow a favor thou hast earned. For a moment, there is an image of figures kneeling in meditation. A bright light and develop some and it fades. I don't know how to meditate uh, in this game at least. <laughs> uh, not Witcher. Okay. Okay. I don't know. Wait, what is it? Oh, is it just some roots? Uh, for a second I thought there was a fade hiding in there. <laughs> fade rift, you know. There's nothing else in here, too. At least uh, hidden by fire. Whale fire. Wait, what is this all about? Uh, fire captured, cold endured, and spirit calm. Okay, so this is like uh, some uh, element trials or something. Okay. This appeared. I may need to use the whale fire in those rooms as well. Now just to check out. Okay, let's save for you know convenience <laughs> and uh, let's try the spirit. There we go. Here we go. Here we go. XP. XP is nice. Excuse me. Um, money for our trouble. I'm fighting for not being bored. Well, level 7. Which came. Someone dead. No problem. Here we go. Shatter you to the hell. <laughs> okay, there's some mage in here. Or I don't know. Who's leaving all these, uh, you know, fire traps. Ah, never mind. Corpse break. Oh, okay. This is a uh, research, research material. It's kind of important, uh, you know. Uh, collecting enough grants some uh, damage bonus, I think. Oh man. Okay, let's break some uh, not so good weapons, maybe. I don't know. It's pretty. Tough inventory management here. <laughs> A problematic, at least. Okay, let's uh, break some. Mm. And the blade. Uh, okay. That should be enough for for some. Uh, I don't know for a few seconds. <laughs> 
until we find some more loot. Okay, that's good. That's, uh, uh, I'll take it for now. Wait, wait, what? Are you all right? That was weird. I feel a bit strange. The magic was drawn to you, possibly because of your mark. The effects were purely benign. If it wasn't a trap, what was it? It may be a reward for those who prove themselves worthy. Oh, snap. Wait a moment here. I wanna check it out. <laughs> Attributes, uh, resistances. Spirit resistance, 4%. I don't mind if I, I save here. <laughs> don't trust, you know, upgrades to stay. <laughs> I'll be sure. No bugging out here. Eh. Games do sometimes such things, you know. You get them, you lose them. Oh, here we go. What is this? Yeah, it's just some valuable junk. Eh. There's some flood gold here. Eh. Just lying about, so. Let's get rich. I saw a shield in the sky hole that I want to buy, and it's like. I don't know. War of Fortune? <laughs> what is in here? There's a spirit calm still. Okay. Alright, this is another. No. Get in there, thing. There's level 11. It's a bit tougher. Damage. Now I drink a potion. Just because this is a bit tough here. There we go. Calm down your ranged attacks here. Pretty rude, actually. Okay, here we go. Interesting, uh, will another, you know, uh, grave also give us some bonus here or not? Okay, dude, uh, be careful. Uh, don't react into popping up uh, traps, so good. Ah, oh, man, uh, I don't know. So much stuff in here. Wait a moment. Why cannot I... I cannot manage my inventory here. Oh, that sucks. Because, uh, because, because this. This is ridiculous. <laughs> oh man, it's a lot of gold here. Yeah, yeah. To random fire damage. We need more shards. Still, uh, hmm. okay. Still need more shards. Oh wow. I need help myself. <laughs> I'm not joking here. Uh, this is r ridiculous. This is a. Uh... Wait a moment. D dude. That would explain shit. Okay. Per distance, intense per distance. Oh man. It's just one little blue to stuff. Ah oh, man, I cannot even. Ugh. Get out of his room. <laughs> Just finally get out of his room and uh, let me manage my inventory. Come on here. Where's the inventory button? What the hell, man? Come on. Here we go. Jeez. <laughs> okay. Let me see here. Uh, so much stuff in here. I don't even know where to start destroying it. Grenade belt. Uh, yeah, this is uh, this is uh, not important. Uh, those life or damage aren't really you know 
that useful is just 50 health as a break anyway so maybe could have been on some tough fight but I don't I really don't know well, please stop you know your nonsense here and uh, come on give me my beneficial there we go let's get out of here it's about time 10% spirit resist Ah, he'll be awful, okay. <laughs> oh yeah, guys. I think we need to, you know, fast travel, get some more shards, maybe... Get, you know, open the last door, maybe. No such things uh, come in free. <laughs> so, yeah. And I think I have a... Uh, spirit resistance worth of... Uh, 10% so that's pretty good not as uh, afraid of uh, you know wraiths anymore because those bastards do spare damage until some uh, elemental demon comes up and then they change their element and maybe should we get some fire resist next I don't know I really get on my nerves, uh, rage demons, you know. Uh, sadly no camp in the vicinity here. It's not not too far. Let's get our, uh, you know, potions. On full and uh, let's our... Uh, <coughs> let's level our party here. As uh, I need to do it. Uh, you know, it's important, important, not to forget the basics. Okay, what does this upgrade do? Okay, flames erupt from a fissure led by earth-shaking strike, damaging enemies that cross it. Uh, wow, interesting stuff. Oh, take it. There we go. Crazy. Okay, Derek, what do we have for you here? A full draw or something from Artificer. Watch your step, you can remain in stealth while using a spike trap and enemies are flung even further into the air. Okay, interesting. Set them up, you master the proper placement of spikes and levers. When you spring any kind of trap, your enemies feel it. Uh, does it stack for like, I don't know. This is kind of trap. Caltrops. <laughs> Spikes. Does this read like? Any kind of trap. Spikes and lovers. <laughs> Hard to say. Okay, opportunity knocks. An, an ally critically hits, you take advantage of her success faster with reduced cooldown times. Oh, that's pretty good, I mean, uh, I am kinda trying to get some critical hits myself that's not bad uh, fallback plan next yeah let's get opportunity knocks that's pretty good well cooldown reduction on uh, direct abilities that should be nice and what do we get for solas here I don't know maybe oh yeah yeah, 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 yeah. Either this tree or let's get some ice going here. Okay, use stray magic around weakened enemies to increase the power of status effects on them. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Crazy. Not too bad. Hmm. Interesting. Basically, whale strike is needed for all of these. Okay, that's pretty, pretty, you know, high requirement. Let's get something, uh, you know, more straight up. 
like uh, ice mine. Freeze duration six seconds, uh, armor reduction. Oh, that could be pretty good. Okay. Some episode over already. Okay. It was uh, a bit shorter episode here. So, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, see you next episode. I'll try to, you know, get this area done a bit faster if I can. And, you know, you know, bye.